When you're using a spreadsheet program like Google Sheets or Excel or any other spreadsheet program, you can use formulas to help you do the math. So you start a formula with an equal sign, and then uh, depending on what you're doing, there are different formulas. So in this case, I want to sum these totals. So I start with sum, and then it's actually suggesting for me cells B2 through B6, which is exactly what I want. So I can click on the suggestion. And then when I hit enter, it will total that for me. Now it can do more than uh, just sum. So if I hit enter again, this time I can find average. And again, it automatically suggested for me the right cell range, which is perfect. And then there it's found out my average for me. Now the neat thing about using formulas versus just typing in the numbers is if you discover, oh, whoops, I made a mistake. Monday wasn't $5, it was actually $50. As soon as you change that number, your total and your average automatically update for you. Now that's a fairly simple example. Here's something else you can do with formulas. Let's say you're figuring out your profit uh, per item. So let's say you sold pizza and it cost you $1.25 before tax. To figure out the tax, you can do equals. And then instead of typing in the actual number, we're gonna type the cell reference. So we're gonna take the number in cell B12 and multiply that by our tax rate in this case, 13%. And when I hit enter, it figures out my tax for me. Total after tax equals this cell plus this cell equals. So this is my total cost to me. Now let's say I sold this pizza for $2 a slice. My profit per sale is then equals this cell minus this cell enter and I want to see more decimal places than that so I'm going to add decimal places so let's say I sold 17 slices of pizza my total profit would be profit per sale multiplied by the number sold enter and then I get my total profit. Now the cool thing with formulas is now if I want to add some more information I don't have to do everything all over again. So let's say pop cost me 50 cents to buy instead of having to retype these formulas again if I just click back in my first cell and grab this tiny little square at the corner and drag it down it will automatically update formulas for me. So let's say I sold it for a dollar. Again, I can just drag down the formula. Oops, I didn't mean to drag down number sold because I would have to know that and put it in. So let's say I sold 25 of those. And then it's just super easy to fill in more information. And it's going to automatically keep doing all the math for me. And again, at any point, if you realize you've made a mistake somewhere, you can always go back and update it. And everything else will automatically update as well. So take advantage of those cell references and take advantage of using formulas in your spreadsheet software to have some really powerful math at your fingertips. Yeah.